I'm gonna pass. I'm gonna pass out. I can't breathe. So it's still New Year's Day. It is 10 to 10. Oh, ish. And it's a motocross thing now. Running a little bit late. So I'm gonna cut this intro short, but I'll see you on the bike, right? Sweet, cool. Uh, <laughs> I'm rushing. <laughs> So what's up guys, My mic, the, I might sound a little muffled because I've got one of those face mask things on because oh my god with this motocross helmet I don't know how it happens but my, my nose is kind of exposed but still the raindrops hit my mouth on my lip and it fucking hurts <laughs> but I'm warming my gloves off on my exhaust it's absolutely freezing out I'm getting absolutely soaked um, so I pulled over to this co-op, but yeah, we're um, we're almost there I think, not long to go, 15-20 minutes maybe. I've brought my camera so hopefully I can uh, get some videos done, film something, but uh, I'm not sure how long I'll stay in this weather, it's absolutely horrible, but I haven't watched motocross in a very, very long time, and I really wanted to, so. <laughs> oh, it's so nice. I don't even know where I'm actually going. I have a postcode to a pub, and then I've got to find some, uh, follow some signposts from there. So, uh, well, if I can't find it, I'll just go to the pub, innit? <laughs> Let us continue. I could get some petrol, actually. Nah, we'll be alright. The rain is so bad. Shenna. The rain is so bad, right? That I have a mask on and I can slurp water out of it. I can hear myself talking in my Senna. Oh my god. It's so cold. Why can I hear myself in my own Senna? <laughs> I'm fucking cold. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, peeps. Oh. I got heavy for a minute, like, proper heavy. <laughs> God damn. Mm. We can't be far now, can we? I'm going the wrong way. I've gone past it. Are you kidding me? So I need to take a left in a minute. Oh. <laughs> Mummy. Oh, let's just fucking do this. I've had enough of... I kind of want to warm up my gloves, but... Oh, it's so wet. I can't get my hands. Through. Come watch motocross, they said. It will be fun, they said. It's signposted, but I don't see fucking anything. Ah, I just have to warm up, man. Just to show you what I'm working with, get the light. That jacket isn't waterproof, so I am drenched 
I've only got a t-shirt underneath this. So, I'm cold, I'm wet. I don't know what I'm doing. So the rain's starting to die down now. I'm absolutely freezing. I found this on the floor, the lighter. So I'm trying to warm my hands up a bit. It's, it's so cold. The pub's not open, so it's not like I can go in there for some more warm food or anything. I still have no idea where I'm going. This might have been a bad idea. I have got this far. I don't know if I should just like turn them out and head back or do I stick it out and try and find out where I'm going. I don't know. I was told there was going to be, you know, that little orange arrow type things. Yeah, so sorry for the shaky camera, I literally could not hold it still. I'm trying my best, I honestly am. But. I think I might have to call this a failed mission and head back. Especially while the rain has died down. I've got no idea where I need to be going. Absolutely no idea. But I'm going to warm up for a bit. And I think I'll head back. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, it's all fun games, isn't it? Right. I think I've come to the conclusion that I'm heading home, like, I'm, I'm too cold, <laughs> I could get in and I could be a cold It's too cold. My feet are frozen solid, like, it is painful how cold it is, how wet they are. It's definitely the worst idea of the year. <laughs> it's the first of January. Oh, great way to start the year. This is <laughs> this just sums up how 2018 is gonna be. Fuck oh, <laughs> Nah, don't do this.
Oh, it's fucking hurt! Oh, I don't know if I want to laugh or cry. I can't feel my fingers. They're numb. They are numb. I can't. God damn it! Moments later. Oh, freezing. Right? Yeah, freezing. Oh, freezing. Yeah. Oh, you're freezing. Yeah. Right. Time for round two. <laughs> As you can tell, I'm in quite a lot of pain. <laughs> my feet. My hands aren't too bad now. They've, they've warmed up a little bit, but I know I've still got about half an hour to an hour but that way and uh yeah I, I just hoping I don't have hyperthermia um I probably won't talk a lot it's probably going to be a lot of screaming and shouting but I'll let you know when I get home Started over in Georgia, pulled it up the back McGeady off the left, and that's where it began Seven against the and the Germans next and so That's when John O'Shea became a god forevermore Slip up against the Scots, the lads kept ahead With Sherman coming over to pour our hearts today Well no one gives a chance, they said that we'd be fair So Randolph locked it up and Trey like stuck it in the net Singing, stand for a f***ing ring Lay all lay and adjust the dream We're heading to the Euros, we're taking all the f***s We won't get hard, but we'll take a second chance Sitting in the shoes, stand for a f***ing green There's one thing I know, stop this time I've seen We're heading to the Euros, we're taking all the f***s We won't get hard, but we'll take a second chance we used to dream of teams like every race But now we jump the waters and we stick up the And we've got Glenn, Glenn to break lads So this touch may be horrible, don't give up And we've got Robbie Brady to take it from the left Coming on the rocks, put on a shit on his chest Make sure to pick up the lows, no shit in the back And what's in the middle to set the attack saying Stand up for the boys in green Lay all lay and a chance to change We're heading to the Euros, we're taking over the house Are you kidding me? No. <laughs> oh, fuck. Guys. I'm out of fuel. Oh, can this day get any worse? Oh, Jesus. Oh. Ah. 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 Oh, fuck me. I'm gonna pass out. I can't breathe. I'm like, please. I can't breathe. Oh fuck, I can't breathe. Keep going. What's up guys? So, I made it back. 
It's actually been a few hours now. I've, I've had food, I walked to the shops, all that kind of stuff, you know. But I completely forgot to outro this video because I made it back, I opened my door, and I just went, oof. I just. I don't want to say I collapsed because I didn't pass out or anything, but I did just. I used all my muscles possible to get myself back. And then that was it. I was, I was done. Laid on the floor and I couldn't get back up. My dad was like, what's wrong, what's wrong? Because I thought my, my parents were out because uh, my niece and my sister are in hospital at the moment. So I, that's why I didn't ring them or anything. I, I, I was like, right, do you know what? I'm doing this myself. I'm getting myself home. Um, I, don't, I didn't want to rely on anyone else. That's why I did it. That's why I was like, now I'm getting home. <laughs> so my dad saw me just go couple on the floor. And he's like, what, what are you doing? My breathing was just, I couldn't breathe. Um, it was like panic breathing. Uh, and yeah, I, I couldn't, he kept telling me to get up. Couldn't fucking push myself up. He kept calling me a tit and stuff, which, you know, which is true. <laughs> but, um, yeah, even now, I, I'm absolutely shattered. To be fair, I've had four or five hours sleep, so not a, not a great deal of sleep. That's not an excuse, I am just tired. But yeah, that was physically and mentally exhausting. There, there, there was points where I was walking it back when it ran out of fuel and I honestly thought I was going to pass out. There was one major point where I, I got so dizzy I was, I was going to pass out. But I want to say this is, there's always like a little secret message behind each video that I make like this and that is to learn from my mistakes. Don't do this, okay? Prepare for a ride. I honestly, I went outside, it didn't feel cold. Um, I didn't check the weather or anything, I just thought, you know, it would be a quick 30 minute ride or an hour ride where I was going. Um, I didn't think it would be very bad and it didn't feel cold outside. I had all my gear on, don't get me wrong, but I had summer gloves on, uh, which are quite thick summer gloves, they're not like thin material, they are full leather. But yeah, I didn't check the weather, so the second it started raining, I got absolutely soaked. Which I can cope with the rain, no problem, I ride in the rain all the fucking time. But it was... As soon as the rain stopped, the temperature dropped so quick, and I was drenched. And because I was so wet, and the, the temperature just dropped so quick, I had all everything was soaking wet. My jacket isn't waterproof, so it seems. It always says waterproof. I swear it says waterproof on it, but it ain't waterproof. I had waterproof trousers on. They actually kept me dry, but my boots. I don't know how. I thought my boots were waterproof. They weren't. My feet were soaked. Um, my feet were actually in so much pain, it was horrible, and so were my hands. But yeah, please don't take risks like I did. Honestly, I think I was very close to having hypothermia, very close. It was it was stupid, but uh, I've been watching, it's, 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 I know this is going to sound really stupid, but I've been watching the SAS Who Dares Win stuff, and watching them, you know, jump into freezing cold rivers and shit like that, and carry on, I'm just like, do you know what, no, I can do this, because... What you guys, I don't know if I've ever told you, I wanted to be a, in, in the Royal Marines. I trained my ass off for it, found out I had an energy, couldn't get in. So, I was like, no, I, I, I'm going to get myself home, I can do this. And I just kept pushing myself. But I wanted to see how far I could push my body. I, it was, I know that sounds stupid, but I wanted to see it. But I shouldn't have been riding, because I was so cold. My, uh, my reaction times would be so much slower. Um, I wouldn't be able to think as quickly. And because I was in so much pain, I just wouldn't have been able to move. It was it was a stupid thing to do. So please, if 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 you're in a situation like that, please just call someone. Uh, don't do what I did and try and make yourself get home. Don't push yourselves to your limit. Uh, it was definitely close to my limit. I was very close to passing out, but I made it home. I did make it home, luckily, um, safe safely. But yeah. It was, I know it's silly, don't take risks like that, prepare for a ride, look at the weather if you're going to go out riding, just to make sure, and stay safe this winter, okay guys? Anyways, I hope you did enjoy the video, I know it was a dumb one, but life is as it is, <laughs> let's start 2018 off good, shall we? Ay yay yay. Anyway guys, have a good new year, we're going to smash it in 2018, uh, a lot of things to come. Yeah, enjoy, see you in the next one.